there are some rules of thumb in predicting HETP which are more accurate and more reliable than mass transfer models. For small diameter columns, the following correlations are available. Equation 8A, HETP is equal to 18 dp. Equation 8B, HETP greater than dt for dt less than 0.67 meters. Where dp and dt are the packing and tower diameters respectively. HETP, dp, and dt are all in meters. These rules of thumb are based on Paul Ring's performance. Another equation proposed by Kista and Larson for Paul rings expresses diameter in terms of surface area per unit volume, or A sub P. A sub P is equal to 5.2 over dP, as shown in equation 9. Incorporating equation 9 to equation 8A yields HETP is equal to 93 over AP, shown as equation 10. Equations 8 and 10 can be applied for random packing with diameter greater than or equal to 25 millimeters, while A sub P of 25 millimeters gives a good estimate of HETP for smaller packings. For structured packings, Harrison and France propose equation 11, which is useful for most packings of different geometries. HETP is equal to 100 C sub XY over AP plus 0.1. Tables 14-13 and 14-14 of Perry's 7th edition provide the specific surface areas required for the past equations. Another method of determining HETP is by interpolation from experimental data, since this method gives more accurate results compared to some rules of thumb. However, this method requires familiarization of several factors which affect HETP, since an incorrect assumption of the effect of these factors could lead to inaccuracy in data interpolation and could result to a poor design. There are a number of factors affecting efficiency, first of which is underwetting. Underwetting is a packing surface phenomenon which breaks up liquid film. A contact angle of zero degrees designates a perfect wetting, while a contact angle of 180 degrees indicates no wetting. Underwetting affects the column due to differences in surface tension which could lower the efficiency of the tower. The quantity lambda equal to MGM over LM has been suggested to have an effect on packed column efficiency. Strigel represented the effect of lambda through equation 9. Actual HETP over standard HETP is equal to 1 plus 0.278 quantity ABS ln lambda quantity cubed. However, a lambda between 0.5 and 2 has little effect on HETP. Beyond these values, HETP rises. High pressure is also a factor in packing efficiency. It has been observed that increasing pressure decreases packing efficiency. However, pressure below 100 millibar has little effect on both random and structured packings. System properties can also affect packing efficiency. Water-rich systems have been observed to yield higher efficiency due to surface underwetting and high lambda. On the other hand, non-aqueous systems generally have little effect on HETP. Finally, Errors in liquid vapor equilibria affect packing and tray efficiency in the same manner. Small errors at low relative volatilities, or alpha below 1.2, have a large effect on the efficiency of both packed and tray columns. However, the effect of low volatilities become meaningless when there is insufficient VLE data.